Is it working now? Um, I won't move, I won't change anything in the story until I get confirmation that someone can hear me <laughs> and that I'm back up. I don't know if I need to start a new stream or if I can just continue this one like that. You can hear? Awesome. Thank you, Kana. Okay, let's move on with the story. That's the second time my internet's cut out today, which is unfortunate, but whatevs. You do what you do, what you do. Okay. Would you like to book the family baths? Oh, that's cute. And everything she's lovely By the way, everyone, the way this staff member is acting now, that is exactly the right way to act um, when you find out that someone is trans in your course of everyday life. You don't make a big deal about it, you just accept it, apologise for getting the terms wrong and just, yeah, just generally act normally. <laughs> The sound is gone for me. Did you get cut out? Oh, I hope not. My computer says I've still got internet access, so I'm hoping that it hasn't cut me off again. Um, I'll just check that my sound's working. get big squish to let me know sounds fine right now they're talking about before oh okay yes uh, sorry <laughs> earlier when the sound cut out um, I'm actually really glad that you said the sound cut out because as soon as I saw that message I looked up and my internet had gone so I guess your message came through just before that, which helped me not continue the story, talking away, thinking I could be heard still. Um, but yes, my internet just cut out, which it does from now, now and then. Uh, 
usually that only happens when Big Squish is also streaming, but occasionally it happens on its own anyway. My laptop just doesn't like to stay connected to the internet, which is one of the reasons I don't stream for very long times. Oh, that was bad English. Some people are definitely kinder than you think they are. Only everyone was. That's adorable. God, I would love to visit a hot spring. Yes, enjoy it, girl. I do like that they don't do the usual bath scene that you get in lots of visual novels where like they're washing themselves beforehand and you get all like the soapy and the steamy air and stuff it's just like come on man you really don't need to sexualize this <laughs> that stuff lady so much she's absolutely my favorite character He's a tinsy bit cooler than you are, Erica. I'm just like treading the fine line there. See back. I'm going to sleep. Have a good feast to make a stream and a great day. Well, thank you, Pinks. I hope you have a good sleep. And thank you for coming and joining me this morning. I really appreciate that. Especially since it's quite early for you.
person that's squished with the words of cozy words. I think you kind of. I hope this is cozy. I tried to pick a positive game today. I really quite like this background music. I usually can't stand background music in games, but this one's just about as chill as the Stardew Valley background music, you know? Tofu Nabi. Nabi? I don't know. Tofu. Yeah, they put bacon in fucking everything. Fuck you guys, you know. Like, really, if you want meat that badly, can't you just, like, have it on the side and mix it in yourself? Like, does every single dish on the table have to have bacon in it? Come on, man. Even the pumpkin soup has bacon sometimes, on top of the chicken stock it's often made with. Ugh. <laughs> Sorry, just a little rant there. Because that is very, very true. <laughs> some veggies are fishy space because veggie has no meat for them so you gotta be careful yes uh i've had issues um i haven't been to japan but i've been to a couple of uh, a couple of different like asian restaurants serving miso soup and i've asked them if the miso has any fish in it and they say no and um and then someone's like oh wait it has Bonito, and I'm like, okay, so it does have fish in it. Thank you. I'll get something without fish. Thank you very much. <laughs> simple the art style is and yet it's so cozy oh I didn't know that dashi is fish based okay I'll keep an eye out for that as well No, you're two cutie pies. This is cuties. I've been for two, three years. I've got this friend never been a few spaces. Yes, I am. Um... 
I'm pretty good at navigating it, you know, when it's in English. <laughs> Which isn't surprising because it's not very difficult, but yeah, you do get some people who think that chicken and fish are vegetarian and it can be very hard to work around people like that because you can't just say vegetarian, you've got to, you have to be very specific. And even then, some of them just, oh. I think I'm gonna have them talk just because we're doing a stream like this. Oh hi Elusive Melody, welcome to the stream. Thank you for coming by and saying hi. How are you doing today? okay um just wanted to do this stream today for transgender day of remembrance i might be heading to a remembrance service later on today i'm not sure yet it depends how my legs are doing if i can walk and stuff oh i didn't know that kana that's so cool i'll have to take you if i ever go to japan <laughs> Yes, I always see these snacks and stuff in the Asian supermarkets and I'm like, I can't get this because it doesn't have English translation for the ingredients. So, like, you'd be surprised. I mean, you wouldn't be surprised, but it is surprising how many snacks involve octopus and fish. Um, I think that's Japanese snacks, but I could be wrong because I can't recognize the difference between the letters. Favorite vegan ramen spot in Japan. What did you shit you? Hey, I'd try it. My worst fear about traveling overseas is not being able to eat. Like, I'd love to go to India, but I'm allergic to the active ingredient in chilies, the thing that makes them spicy. And I'm just terrified that if I ever go to India, I'll have to survive off of white rice with nothing else on it, just because otherwise I could die. <laughs> and then, like, it's a similar issue with the vegetarian in other countries like oh I don't like rice I don't want to live off of rice <laughs> yes oof Erica come on <laughs> Oh no, Erica, stop it. Oh. Okay, for reference, the staff member behaved very well earlier. That's the way you should do it. Erica is behaving understandably, but impolitely.
Stop asking for dead names. Come on, man. Just gonna leave this explanation up for a little longer than usual because <clears throat> sorry. Because that is it. So people are like, oh, what's the harm in asking what your name used to be, or asking what your legal name is, asking what your birth name is. It's like, well, it's irrelevant. So the like there's no genuine reason to want to know that. Night Valian. Hi, hi, little squish. Oh, wow, that's so cute. Hi, Night Valian. Thank you for coming to my stream. This is an adorable game called One Night Hot Springs, which is free to play on Steam. I'm playing the A Year of Springs version, which has One Night Hot Springs, and it looks like it also has two other games in it that you can't access until you finish this one. So I have played One Night Hot Springs before, which is why I know all about the characters. Um... I definitely recommend this game to everyone, uh, especially if you're a cis person who doesn't really realise the extent of what cis privilege really is. Like, this is just a short story about a trans woman going to a hot springs and all the tiny little obstacles that, are, that trans people have to navigate that cis people just can just ignore. That's cis privilege. Um, blah blah blah. Uh, so that wasn't aimed specifically at Unite Valian, that was just a general <laughs> thing. So I don't know if you're cis or trans or whatever. Like, just <laughs> I wasn't specifically talking to you. That was just a general. Oh, I'm over explaining. Sorry. <laughs> I'm just not making assumptions about anyone. Okay. Big squish is a cutie pie. Yes, this is a requirement in some countries. It's still a requirement in some countries. Like now, 2022, there are still countries where you cannot change your legal gender without being sterilized. Like, the law literally requires you to be unable to have children before they will let you change your gender. Well, your legal sex, I mean absolutely ridiculously outdated that's um yeah gender reformation surgery is also very expensive so countries where you cannot change your legal sex without getting gender affirmation surgery regardless of sterilization or not I mean, gender affirmation surgery usually sterilizes, but it depends on what you're getting. Um, but it's still, it's expensive. It's just cruel to have them tied to things like that when you can't, you know, like only rich people can get this stuff done easily. Everyone else is like, saving up for years decades even or it's just completely unattainable whether they would want it or not which means that in these particular countries where you have to have the surgery before you can change your legal gender a legal sex for the rest of your life you have to be called the opposite of what you actually are just because you aren't rich 
mind-bogglingly cruel. It's such a tiny little thing, but it's it's like a little splinter under the nail, you know? shit they have in a lot of places. Yes, the artwork is adorable. I love it. It's so simple, but absolutely perfect. Be brave. Do it, girl. It's a lot easier to be brave in a story where you know that there are no bad endings. Well, there's one bad ending, but I've already bypassed that by going to the hot springs instead of living in a tiny little cave by myself like a hermit. <laughs> The stream's been going for half an hour. I bet it's gonna cut out soon. <laughs> it doesn't like me going for very long at a time.
such a cutie pie. Look at her with her hair up like that. By the way, I really appreciate so many people coming and watching today. I know five viewers or seven viewers isn't a lot for some people, but for me it's a lot. And I'm at 2.9 average viewers on my stream, so this stream just might bring me over the three viewer threshold to get affiliate. I'm not sure. Do you see Joe's last 60 seconds wrong on my Discord? No, I didn't. I didn't know you were in Joe's Discord. 60 second drawing it is a bunny rabbit on a blue cube is that us let's see why i didn't come to back Pass, I guess. Yes, the little towels on the heads. I have no idea why it's so cute, but it's just so cute.
I guess so.
I mentioned before, that was a bit emotional today. I'm just like tearing up so much right now. <laughs> it's just so sweet. I love this game so much. Okay, so I did say it would be a short game. Uh, I think it took about one and a half to two hours. It's hard to tell because the string cut out halfway through. Okay, so the next game is unlocked now that I've done that. So thank you all for joining me today. I really appreciate it and I hope that you all have a good transgender day of remembrance if that is even possible. <laughs> but, yes. I love you all and thank you for joining me today. I really really appreciate it and I'm always here for anyone who just needs someone to talk to. about these sorts of things, you know? Okay, thank you and I'll catch you next time. Bye.